Welcome back to Squawk Box. Alaska Airlines flight attendants rejecting a new labor deal that would have raised pay by an average of 32 percent over three years. The union and the company reached that tentative deal in June, but the rank and file members failed to ratify it. The union says it's going to survey its members to determine key issues and then try to return to the negotiating tables to address them. A U.S. judge said yesterday he's planning to issue an order that would force uh, Alphabet's Google to give Android users more ways to download apps. The judge heard from technology experts and lawyers for Epic Games and Google about proposed reforms in the blockbuster antitrust case. The judge said Google foreclosed competition for years and years and years. We're opening the gate now and letting competitors come in. Epic's lawsuit accused Google of monopolizing how consumers access apps on Android devices and how they pay for in-app transactions. And Kansas City Chief CEO Clark Hunt says the Taylor Swift craze helped fuel a 30% increase in the team's fan base amid its Super Bowl winning season. Swift began dating Chiefs tight end Travis Kelsey last year and made frequent appearances at the games. Hunt said her impact stunned the league, which confirmed that 30% metric without disclosing how exactly it measured the fan base. All right. High I, stakes I, I, in that relationship yes. apparently here. Yeah. Well, yes, but also, I don't know. Are you saying it's a loose definition of fan? Yeah, are you possibly suggesting that and, this might not be And perhaps he may not have too many years left. playing left? Yeah, we'll see. <laughs>